Hey YouTube, Brown S here, and I'm going to review another Godzilla figure. Now, I just want to say, um, I know this figure has bad sizing. Just gonna say that. So, here he is. King Ghidorah. I know that he has bad sizing. But, uh, let's see with our stuff. Um, history, um, um, uh, see if I can remember. The first movie he appeared in was Ghidorah. Ghidorah the three head, or uh, Ghidorah the three head, head monster. If I can remember cor correctly, I think, I think that he was a mirror, uh, who appeared to be a three head dragon, King Ghidorah. Huh? Hmm, who then attacked, then Godzilla, Rodan, and then Mothra came in and stopped him. Um, he also made an appearance in, uh, Godzilla vs. Monster Zero, who, which King Ghidorah was to go her by these aliens. And from Planet X? What do they call these aliens? I forgot what, what kind of aliens there, but uh, he was taken over by these air aliens. And then in his next movie, Godzilla vs. King Ghidorah, well, um, um, uh, the Godzilla Saurus was replaced by three cute little Dorats. It's, it's, um, when the atom bomb went off, uh, it merged the three into King Ghidorah, which is the people from the future controls. Was after Godzilla, after the new Godzilla uh, killed him, um, um, he was brought back to life to stop uh, the new Godzilla as Mecha King Ghidorah. Which I don't have. And then his next appearance came. I mean, Godzilla, uh, Mothra, King of the Giant Monsters are all attack. Heck, he was one of the uh, um, uh, monster guardians. Or guardian monsters. He was one of the guardian monsters. There is. There is him. Um, he, he got defeated three times. Was the first time um, is when. And Godzilla shot his tongue breath at him when he was knocked out. Then after Mothra died, and, um, um, her power was given to King Ghidorah to stop Godzilla. And when Godzilla and King Ghidorah were underwater, King Ghidorah died again. And but then, and the last part of of his stone, own was, uh, was dropped underwater, uh, which then floated uh, down to him, which gave him more power. Her, her, along with the ability to finally shoot lightning, and, but then got killed again by Godzilla, for real this time. And three strikes, you're out. Oh. <laughs> so for sculpt, well that's it for history. For sculpt, um, it's a really good sculpt. I like how its body looks, along with the feet. I love how the heads look, like along how big the wings are. And his tails look really good sculpt. For details, well, it's, it's like the Chibi King Ghidorah, it's all gold. Well, I love how I love the detail. Those, those, and the details of his face, oh, or his faces, wow, really good. Articulation, um, he has three points. You can move its wings and its tail 360 each. Why well, don't get as why aren't the heads articulated? I think the heads should have articulation. Now, uh, for sizing, and uh, I already size compared her to with Godzilla. This my uh, two Godzillas. This, and it's bad sizing. King Door has to be bigger. But I haven't sized compared him with King Caesar. Let me get King Caesar straight. I just can't stand this. This is just bad sizing. And that. Sizing is just bad. And not for the score. 
history, um, he has a big history, so I'll give it a 9. And sculpt, I'll also give a 9. And details, give a 10. And articulation, I'll give it a 6. And for sizing, bad sizing, so I'll give it a 4. And it equals 38. So, oh, I would give this figure a 7.5. Hey, hey, it's a good figure with good details or good history, details, sculpt, sculpt not so much articulation and bad sizing. Hey, it's still a recommendable figure or if you want the rival of the King of the Monsters. There's, so, that's it for this interview.